Assurances are not enough because, you know, there is that common saying that talk is cheap. It's one thing to talk. It's another thing to walk your talk. Yes, talk is cheap. It's one thing to talk. It's another thing to walk that talk, especially for an EC that has a, a very troubling track record. You remember how in the past we've had opportunity to raise concerns with how they've done things. You remember the, the most recent one, the exhibition of the voters register, all right, where it was very clear that, I mean, they needed to re-exhibit. You see, we had to make a lot of noise. Then eventually they said, OK, they would allow people to use text, uh, the code to verify whether they are uh, registered, they are on the register, etc. Mm -hmm. You remember also this common matter of the forensic audit, something that was done in Kenya and which brought them a lot of dividends. EC just agreed for us to do forensic audit. That too was a tango for a long time, right? Mm -hmm. I remember even the chief, chief of Gosu, Nana Kwesi Busumpra, joining the fray. You could see for a chief, it was trouble because everybody, I mean, most of us, People who wanted progress for Ghana just saw it as easy. If one of the biggest stakeholders has concerns, what was it going to cost to do this forensic audit? Especially as even it was said that the UNDP had agreed to fund it. It was not going to be the taxpayers' money. And can you imagine what dividend the forensic audit would have brought? It would have given us a lot of uh, 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 credibility. It would have shored up the credibility of the EC. And don't forget, this is an EC that has its IT systems being manned by what? MPP uh, persons. The, uh, the, this is number one, Anfu Kwachi's son. Anfu Kwachi is one of Ikufadu's trusted advisors. Yeah, Anfu Kwachi, the one who got uh, convicted for the narcotic drugs. His son. It is not his son. It is not his son. Who is he? It is not his son. Mm. Who is, who is what, it's, 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 it's not his son. His son. Okay. Who is he? Counsel. But who is he? So it's a relation between his very direct son. It's a relation. He must have taken care of him. Because for this to have come, this he must have taken care of him. He must be a relation. Yes, okay. yes. That, yeah, that's why he's refusing to answer that one. Uh -huh. And in Ghana, when we say son, ah, son, we all were. Uh, help you. Like, yeah, you know the doctor is just <laughs> that. Oh, I'll Google, please, viewers, people know his name. Oh, I'm um, coming. Okay. So let so, me go on. Yeah. So those people are in charge of the IT system. So I'm yet to come to the commissioners. These guys. Anfu Kwachi's relation and the doctor, openly MPP. They are in charge of the IT system. And when I say IT system, let's remember in 2016, when we wanted John Mama out, and the MPP went and brought uh, Joe Anochi, the NCA boss. Yeah, we're happy. They say, yes, Joe Anochi, uh, this an IT guru. He was coming to he counter the and, NDC. He went and so that's what they were Excellent. And we're happy, yeah, because that in 2016, we wanted Mahama out. So when Duanochi arrived, he was like, yes, Jesus had come, the man with the eyes. And truly, he was said to have thwarted NDC efforts to rig the elections, right? Uh -huh. So today, if you have an MPP man in charge of the IT system, oh, viewers, this man's name, I, I won't what, be happy. Why you look at you? Can there's no way. Yes, yeah, so I'm continuing. Yes. I won't be happy. Then next level, let's come to the commissioners. Dr. Apia Hini. Kodeo itself has come out. Kodeo. Kodeo is the largest election monitoring body, the largest CEO. So Kodeo, from his con uh, the way it's constituted, represents all Ghanaians, from the chief imam to the churches, other CSOs. Kodeo said, look, we draw Dr. Pia Hine, an MPP foot soldier, as a commissioner. Kodeo, please, it's not... As he just saying it, Kodeo, the body that represents all of us, said no. The appointment of Apia Hini and the Salima lady were not on. They are too close, and the Reverend Minister are too close to the MPP. Then next, I'm coming to Bosman Asari. Bosman Asari, who taught his students, said NDC is an existential threat to Ghana's democracy. Mm -hmm. A professor who, that NDC is an existential threat. Oh, initially, you know, those days, it looked good. Right? Until Ekufado came and performed far worse than John Mama. They would say that, ah, what this professor said is rubbish. Yeah. You see, those days, because he was said that uh, MPP were elites, yeah, they were supposed to be better. But now we've seen. 
that your mama who is not a lawyer has performed far better than a lawyer. I mean, that's where my pain is. Really no, no, yeah, no, that, that was the narrative. Uh, uh, oh, that's, yes. That's not, no, I didn't really no, elite. No, no, and so, that's no, why I say, I'm talking no, about no, the year no, 2000. So I'm looking at the pivot time. You see, starting from 2000. Yeah, those days. Maybe if you were in here. No, I know. In those I, days. I know yeah, 2000. No, no, no. Uh -huh. no, so it was no, said no. that NDC, they were made up of the masses, veranda boys, <laughs> etc. So if you were in the university, remember Professor Jampo, those days. Hey, you didn't want to see anything close and be associated with NDC at all. If you're in the university, yeah, elite, ah, as a university student, you thought that, yes, you belong to MPP. But now time is shown as that Mahama, who is not a lawyer, has performed far better than Ekufuado. But are you surprised? You know when Ekufuado went to the University of Ghana? He didn't do well. Ekufuado was a struggling student. Was it third class or pass? You see, in 2008, when Atamins was there, all these records were brought out. Then, you know, eventually, you see how God too behaves. That's my problem with God. At a mills was honest, he died. Then these bad boys, they live longer. That's mm -hmm. the irony in life. So my point is that Eko Fuado came to University of Ghana, performed very poorly. Poorly, 10th class, was he a pass? Such a person, do you think becoming president, he was suddenly going to become Solomon? Do you think somebody who made that grade, 10th class, was he a pass in economics, was suddenly going to become an economic misery in government. No. So that's why we chose. We're hoping that, oh, having left school, you know, some people may not do too well in the classroom. They come into the field and they excel. And so because there are those few cases, just like those ones I've won in the court, oh, MPP versus AG and the rest. So we thought the man had transformed. Me, it was even later. Look, Justice Kulendi, when he's teaching his students, he said he wrote those submissions, the cases that Ikufuadu won. Kulendi said it. it you asked lawyers who have been graduating in the last few years. Yes, when he teaches, he says the submissions, MPP versus AG, those cases, he wrote them. So it means that Kufado just read. So for me, the time he was coming, <laughs> because he had okay. won those cases, I thought, oh, with those submissions, then the man is transformed. It's turned out that um, he has never transformed from the third but class. Your, your, oh, okay. your question was on the EC. So really? why have you brought so, so, uh, so, 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 then I came to the commissioners, right? Then I came to Bosma Asari. So it was Bosma Asari's own that led us to the... Oh, it's not DJ It's very, very connected, right? So you see, and he's very important because, you know, Ikufado has, uh, what do you call it, put down a lot of state institutions. He's not allowing them to work. So I'm coming to that. That a man who didn't do well in school, struggling with a third class or a pass, what do you think? That when he becomes president, he suddenly will become a first class material or he will excel? No. You know, Atta Kennedy, he, he wrote the book, Chasing the Elephant into the Bush. We should have read Dr. Atta Kennedy's book over and over. He said it. But you see, at that time in 2016, Mama had annoyed us so much that no, they, I mean, we just weren't ready to take any more from him, right? Uh -huh. So my point is that your question was easy. Am I, you run uh, for me. This, yes, am I happy? I say no. And I'm even happy, Professor, from Pom Boatin is coming to continue. Ah, the legendary from Pom Boatin. Yeah, that, you remember earlier on, I'd said it that people who have taken positions in this government but later saw bad governance and are speaking up should be louder. You see, I, I, I mentioned uh, Sofa Yekufu. Mm -hmm. I should add Professor from Pom Boatin. Yes, he was minister. 500 excavators got lost, etc. Later, he saw that no, he can't continue with this narrative. He has to disassociate himself. So he's come out, right? So it's an important part. So discussing all of this, I'm saying that I can't be assured that the EC would deliver credible elections, considering how the IT system is manned by MPP uh, apparatchikis, how the deputy commissioners, etc., are MPP. Some even saying that NDC is an existential threat, and then how Ekufuado is not allowing public institutions to work, declaring agent, everything. He will go in okay. there and try to make sure that the MPP has its way. So we've searched, and I was coming to the Afro barometer. The Afro barometer shows that trust in the EC is gone down. The Mo Ibrahim index shows that trust in the EC is gone down. So, so how what, can what could they have done to improve on this trust? So, going forward. Number one, look, that forensic audit, is it late? It's not. This week, they can do the forensic audit. For me, okay. look, we just got tired. It doesn't mean we've accepted. The forensic audit is still important. Let's do the forensic audit. Eh? It would help. That's one. Then two, 
it's good that finally they've considered that the decision to restrict the media accreditation is not the best, so they are going back to consult. I allowed, should I even allow them? But the thing was so, so, so clear. It was common sense. Media, the fourth estate of the realm, you know when they started referring to media as fourth estate? My check showed that 1771, Edmund Buck, they saw that media are very, very important. There's even this very famous quotation by uh, Jefferson. Please, you can Google it. He, uh, paraf I'm paraphrasing it. Thomas Jefferson was fourth president of the US. He says, look, he prefers a society without a government but a media to a society with a government but no media. Okay. Yeah, you can Google it. Thomas Jefferson, he was ambassador to France and then fourth uh, this is president of the U.S. So can you imagine, in the 1800s, people saw the strength of the media. And then going back to 1771, when the media, as the fourth estate of the realm, is said to have been used for the first time by uh, Edmund Burke, yes. eh? UK, uh, uh, this uh, is a uh, uh, member of parliament and other things, a philosopher, mm -hmm. etc. Right? Mm -hmm. So this thing has been there for long. We've always seen that the media is a strong pillar of a democracy. So you see that because Jimensa and his uh, uh, her deputies are lightweight, they don't even know much, they don't appreciate what a democracy is, so they would lightly think that they can shatter aside the media. I mean, I'm okay. not surprised. Finally, you see, remember Jimensa, when she was coming to me, I said it. I said this is not somebody who had distinguished herself as an intellectual giant. Disagrees. She hadn't he, distinguished he, herself he, either at the bar as a lawyer he, or even in any practice. Look, she was on the uh, commission, you, you, you Constitution the, Review Commission. She didn't excel I'll, there. I'll respond, don't mind. The Constitution Review Commission. Oh, 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 she went there, she didn't excel, oh, 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 etc. Oh, oh. The men had never excelled anywhere that you say oh, okay. yes. I, uh, yeah, small uh, CSO, she could be executive secretary, people will write, really? then she will read. People, like, really? people would write. You guys were writing and she was reading. Yeah, I, like the way sure Plenty says, you know? he wrote yes, and the read. You don't so know that. So the men has you don't never been an intellectual giant. So I'm not surprised. I said it from the one. And okay. it's because of her relationship with uh, among others, Rebecca Kufuadu, the first lady, etc. Right? That is how okay. she got there. And well, so we are paying the price uh, okay. for the no, 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 family and friends. To, we, quick one on this matter. No, no, okay. Je, Je, um, um, Martin, I think um, sometimes you can make your point without attacking mm. um, the person. Mm. I, I believe that um, they are clearly on this table, we all agree that. Um, there are challenges um, with regards to the work of the Electoral Commission. And my view is that um, we, we talk about the challenges dispassionately and then encourage the Electoral Commission to appreciate the fact that, why are you laughing? <laughs> you, are, you are confusing you are, me. You are confusing That's why you have to declare. No, no, no. No, no. So we, 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 we talk about the challenges dispassionately mm -hmm. and then also urge the Electoral Commission to appreciate the environment in which it works. Because my view is that it, it, it sometimes feels that, look, everything it does would win the acceptance of all. But they don't trust you. And so that should make you want to um, inch up your performance such that you would not be um, blamed. I think this should be the focus. Um, but to talk about um, her past record, I think for 10 years, this was someone who brought 10, 14 years, so somebody, someone who brought political party leaders together to discuss issues of national importance in an April car manner. Um, I think it's ever since that program collapsed, we've not had any inter-party dialogue um, and platform again. So I think that, yes, um, um, she she has uh, why are you signaling? You, you are confusing me. I think no 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 no. I'm not struggling. No, 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 no. I'm not struggling. Uh, uh, um, I, I, I think the point is that the point is that we have the right to disagree and make our points, but let's not attack the person. I mean, and more importantly, everybody in, in Ghana knows that Jimensa Jimensa Jimensa. What's my boss? And I. No, I, you call this I, an attack. I, no, no, no but, uh, but, but, but talking about, I mean, the kinds of things that you speak. Ah, I said she had an Excel. Oh, what, she had an Excel. What, 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 what did you use in, in, in determining. May I check? Uh, she was at the Constitution Review Commission. She didn't do so, Jack. What, what, oh, please. Ah, please. Do you remember so, what so, I said about it? So, who did, who oh. did what at the CRC? Okay. Who will you read? I checked with commissioners at the CRC. No, no, no. You can make your point, but let's 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 start. That's why Ghana. No, but you can make your point because there's no. 
what, 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 who went to grade them the work that they did? That's the work Who went to who went Trump. to grade the work at the at, at, so at the CRC? Is it just the CRC or, or, or who who, who graded the work of the CRC? Why? The whole work of the CRC has been abandoned by Akufuado. And so why are you now trying to? No, but we're talking about it. Why are you now making noise? Why are you now saying that only Jimmy Sanders didn't perform? I mean, stop that. Please, you cannot you cannot attack some people. Are you still are you still affiliated to the IEA? Well, I'm, I don't, no, I'm not affiliated to the IE. Mm -hmm. But the point is that, I mean, if it is right, it is right. If it is wrong, it is wrong. I think we've made our points on this particular matter. But I don't like the tangent that <laughs> Matthew right. Pebu is going. Ah, no, but the case Thank is you. okay. Thank you, you, you very you've much. You've spoken my mind. I've spoken my mind. Let's no. let, let it go. Do I have no. a, a one no. minute to You don't have any one minute to do anything. You don't have one minute to do anything. We are going on. All what you've touted her for in multi-party no, democracy. Thank you very much. Let me indicate that we're live on 3FM 92.7. You agree? Your microphones are off.